you know, one of our, when, so when we, we hired an agency to do like our, our, our digital, our Facebook, Instagram advertising, right? And it was unsuccessful, failed. What did not work, the return on investment wasn't good. And, um, and when looking into it, so then we kind of had to go back to the drawing board and the long and the short is that we realized that we had to kind of learn these things are, we had to kind of invest in it and kind of at least we had to have that foundational understanding to know enough to be dangerous within these platforms to be able to understand to, if you, you, if you're not giving direction to these agencies, then, then it's, it's not going to, it's, there's a high chance, there's a high likelihood that it's not going to work because you have to, you're the only one that knows the messaging the best, you know, the audience, the best. And if you know that the best, and then, just understanding that foundation to really be able to say, hey, I can try something within Facebook and Instagram, I really was a game changer. So for example, I, I was, you know, which kind of goes back to the data point, they had kind of set up like 15 campaigns, this agency, 15 campaigns. So overall, when we looked at the, 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 the ROI, it was terrible. But then I was kind of going through the numbers and I saw like one, literally one of the 15 campaigns, I was like, man, this one kind of worked, right? The, the number of people who clicked, so the visitors was good, kind of going back to these metrics. The number of people that was clicking on products was good, and the conversion, and the number of people that were buying was good. I was like, man, this one, one out of the 15. I was like, man, let me just kind of turn turn this thing back on and see if it works. And then, and then from there, this was like a $2,000, $3,000 budget. You know, now, so now, you know, now today, now today, you know, we have a, you know, we spent a, a, few, a few, a few million on those, on those channels, but this literally started with a couple grand a month and the results, you know, we, and then we, we kind of understand, okay, why did this creative work better than some of the others? And then from there, you know, those are the three things that show I, my long, my long answer here is Facebook and Instagram, a very traditional channel. You can start that off with a really, with a relatively small budget. But I strongly encourage anybody to really um, to know enough to be dangerous to be able to do it yourself because you got to know how to be able to call bullshit. You got to be able to know to be able to say, hey, I understand the foundational components of how digital marketing works. And that is basically like, OK, who's the audience? Who's the audience I want to target? And you can upload that easily on Facebook. What's the creative that I think will really resonate? And your users are going to tell you that for sure. Um, and um, and then you want to have um uh, yeah, and then just making sure that the creative really kind of conveys that, and you having the ability to be able to tweak that on that low budget level is great, great learning for you. So when you start hiring somebody, or when you, or, for, or if you want to really get someone some expertise, you know enough to be dangerous, and you can do that on a budget.